السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ ویلکم ٹو سیول اکنامکس آئی ریسیوڈ اے میسیج فرام ون آف مائی فرینڈ ون آف مائی ویور مسٹر دانش اسلام ہی آس می دیر از اے ایس ایم ڈی کوڈ اے سکس ڈبلیو دیٹ از ٹرانزسٹر اس ڈاٹا از ناٹ اویلیبل آن گوگل کائنڈلی سجیسٹ می اے نمبر اور سم ڈاٹا فار دیٹ اے سکس ڈبلیو آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو شیئر دس ایس ایم ڈی components data book with you and uh, we will discuss how we can use this in first page there is a index 2 pin 3 pin sot 89 sot 223 4 pins 5 pins 6 pins so this page uh, this book is divided with pin numbers if you want to find two pin components three pin components then you have to go to the specific index here it's description column 1 fsmd code second column the type designations corresponding to the components what is a specific number for that equivalent code then there is a device what type of the device is it diode is it ic it's digital ic a short definition and you can find its explanation here then there is short description if you find adj that means it's adjustable a double t attenuator the abbreviation used in the description for description column you can find it here for example exc that means external or osc oscillator tmos trench fet mosfet so you can find like this then there is column number 5 it will case that is the case package style pin number 6 is pin assignment pin number 7 is schematic pin number 8 is style package style then there is manufacturer so let's see as i discussed all the components are divided into the pin category pin two pin category so two pin might be in this shape might be in this shape in this shape so all these two pin components are enlisted here in this catalog as we discussed the first that is smd code type function short description case the package style pin and style and manufacturer now we have to find a6w just only if you have in laptop in the computer pdf reader at adobe acrobat reader you can search it a6w in android you can download pdf viewer and you can go to three pin component three pin list now we can see a6w it is displayed in page number 230 our friend asked that it is transistor but no it is not a transistor it is bas16 bas16 that is silicon diode and it is fast rectifier diode that is 75 volt 215 milliampere 250 milliwatt 6 nanosecond recovery time and its case its package is sot23 what is sot23 go to google.com and type it sot23 so sot23 in image its image is small outline transistor it is like this and its measurements are here how much centimeter is its outline width length height pin gap pin width pin size pin length every data is displayed here then there is 16 dc 3 aphc in pin equivalent code 16 dc then 3a that is style and then phc that is manufacturer so to see the data for these three columns go to the end of the document so phc that means ph means flips so phi that is flips gmbh germany phc flips china so it's made by flips china 
in the last column PHC that is flips China. Then there is 3A in package style. Here is 3A. It must have marking in this size, in this style. So you can find directly the code number X, Y, Z, whatsoever. A, 6, W, it will be written here. Every package style, marking style have its unique style. If 3E, that means there should be codes like in this way. But in our case, A6W, A6W must be written here. Now we have 16DC, the pin assignment. For pin assignment, go to figure number 16. Here we have figure number 16. This is 3 pin component. 1, 2, 3. From top view, how we can judge the component style? Pin number 1 with a left, pin 2 at right, pin 3 is at one side. Now we have to search for DC, that is for pin assignment. It is in alphabetical order. So here is DC. DC. Pin number 1 is anode, pin number 2 not connected, pin number 3 is cathode. So it is now verified that this component is not a transistor, it is a diode. If you cannot find SMD diode, you can use it, you can replace it with BAS16 diode or any equivalent. And uh, I will give the link of this data book in the description. Download this book from that link. If you have any question, let me know in the comment box. And if you have not subscribed my channel, if you want to watch my future videos then subscribe it and like it and press bell icon button so you will be not notified for my new videos. Thanks for watching.